This is Courtney Rowan for Aggie L T V. With me today is Co a and running backs coach, Coach Randy Jordan. Coach Jordan, can you explain to me about the extra responsibilities that there is this year with you helping out with special teams? And involved heavily with the PAT field goal and also the kickoff return unit and the return units in general. And uh, what it's allowed us to do is, is, is sprinkle our personality into it. And um, also I'm involved with the running backs. And uh, so, you know, I don't see it as an extra load. You know, I'm, I'm really excited about it. I get a chance not only to coach the running backs, but I also get a chance to coach the defensive backs, the linebackers. So I get to know those guys even, even better. With the running backs this spring, what, what improvements are you looking to make with the players, specifically with Christian Michael and Cyrus Gray? I think uh, with Christian, I think the biggest thing is slowing the game down. You know, he's, he's like the Energizer Bunny. He gets the ball and it's, he wants to go right now. Um, you just got to be able to slow the game down and, and let things happen. And uh, he's a tremendous talent, but sometimes he can outrun people in, in terms of the, his blocks. And he's got to be able to set them. Um, I think Cyrus Gray is having one of his better camps. You know, he's a guy we can depend on. Um, I think the thing with him is um, um, it's being able to, to see the overall scheme in terms of picking up the blitzes uh, when they come, which he's improving on. Um, he's, he's a tremendous runner. So um, those two, two guys, they work well to go together, and I think they'll have a good year. Um, with those two both being very experienced this past year, what strengths do you think that they both bring and that make them both unique that will help you decide who's going to play? Well, I think the biggest thing is both of them are very, very competitive. I mean, they, they cheer for each other. Um, they, 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 they feed off each other. And I think the biggest thing that will separate the two is, is consistency. You know, being able to come out here day in and day out um, and put in a good day's work. Um, I always tell backs, put, bring your lunch pail every week and every day when you're practicing, you'll get better. And I think that's the thing that will eventually separate either one from each other in terms of playing time. With Christian putting up such high numbers last year as a true freshman, does that add extra pressure to you for him to come out next year and do the same thing, if not even more, and apply that to all the rest of the running backs as well? No, 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 no. There's no pressure on me. I, I, I train them as, as hard as I can throughout the week, and I just say, hey, this is, when you come out here on Saturdays, uh, this is like a concert. This is your day. I don't coach on Saturdays, and, and they know that. And I think the biggest thing is for, for both of those guys, as, as Kristen that you spoke of, he did put up good numbers, but you're only as good as your last game. I always tell them that. You're only as good as your last game. So um, that keeps him grounded, and he has a lot to prove. Um, because of what he did last year. So it should be an interesting season for those running backs. All right, thank you, Coach Jordan. No this has been Courtney Rowland for Aggie LTV.